Hello everyone. Um, in this video today, I'm gonna show you how to do this like shadow eye thing. So yeah, okay. I'm not wearing any makeup right now, and okay. I'm gonna put like a wingtip thing on it too, but I'm only gonna do one eye because I'm gonna have to take it off later. So yeah, okay. I'm gonna start off with this. Olay primer. Um, it actually like makes my skin feel really soft. So yes, and I'm only putting about that much on my eye because it like it's just like the perfect amount. And I actually I think I got too much. I'm just putting it around my eye because I really don't feel like doing both of them right now. But it's like, it's like, um, moisturizer. But it's for, like, wrinkles and stuff. Well, I guess that's what moisturizer is. So, yeah. My skin's really soft right now. And... I actually don't get pimples or zits or anything at all, so I'm kind of really lucky when it comes to that. I usually actually don't take my makeup off because I'm like really bad to my skin, but I never get any um, pimples or anything like that. And this is actually Olay. It's um, the same, like the same type. It just has like a push pump thing right there. It's Olay and CoverGirl, so it's really good makeup. Okay, see, it looks like a little lighter, like my dark circles or whatever. Okay, and now I'm going to... My sister actually has my other black eyeshadow, so I'm just going to be using this Revlon Diamond Lust. Eh. Um, it's just really sparkly and stuff, so if you're like going out or something, then it'll be something to use. I'm like, I start off with the corners of my eye, I'm using this type of brush. It's not even a brush, this thingy. Because my brush doesn't work very well with this type. Because it's not like an actual eyeshadow. Oh, forgot something. Okay. This is Bright Eyes. It is, um, it's from Rue 21. And I don't really shop there, but I went in there once with my sister. It's like really shiny. So it's going to go with the shadow pretty well. And right now it doesn't really look very good, but it'll look good when it's done. <laughs> okay. Sorry if this video is really long, I don't really know how to edit yet, so I have to ask someone how to edit. And I'm just basically, like, mm, like, putting the most, like, a lot right here, so it's, like, really dark right there, and then, wait, yeah, um, so it's like really dark right there, and then it gradually gets lighter. And now I'm going to use this, this Diamond Lust also. Um, 
it's still Revlon, and it's just sober. I'm gonna put that on the top lid. This would be good if you're going to like a party or something. And really, you can do it with any color you want, so you could be like rainbow or something. I don't know. So, it's like really sparkly. You can't really tell. No, I guess not. Okay, and now I'm going to be using this masterpiece, Master Precise Maybelline New York um, liquid eye. It's like a pen, sort of. I don't know if you can really tell very well. Um, and it's really black. I couldn't find one very well. Um, hold on, this doesn't look good. And I normally do my makeup like this because, well, you know, I don't do it exactly like this, but sort of like it because I don't know, I really like doing the, um, the, um, the wingtip thing, like, this looks so weird, like, okay, um, I don't really use eyeliner very much, maybe I should, but, whatever, oh, and I'm using Mega Plush volume by Maybelline New York and the brush looks like this and it puts so much volume like that's like before and then the I'm just gonna put on top lid okay and then like after maybe you can't really tell but like in person it's like a really huge difference. So yeah, that's basically what I do for my um, shadow. Like um, it gets from light to dark. And yeah, hope you enjoyed. Um,